So there you are. I think whatever else does change, some things don't change. And it's why you're here today, and you're here because of the love you have for one another. That's just trip it to the bare bones. That's what it is. But in actual fact, take that stage further. Why are they all here today? And they're here because of the love they had for you guys and also for your respective families. It's the greatest emotion in the world. The Apostle Paul, a long, long time ago, 2,000 years ago, wrote to some Christian people in this great city of Corinth and he said, there are three things important in life. And he said, these three things are faith, hope, and love. And we may all see them differently because there can be different interpretations for faith and hope but no money for love. And I think we would all come together when we say the greatest is love, and it's your love that's brought us here. And on behalf of everybody, we say to you both, we hope you have a long life, a happy life, but most importantly, a loving life. God bless you. You look absolutely fabulous. I think you better give another kiss and a hug. Yeah. Right. <laughs> to give up right now not this way cause I love you and I wanna hold you when we're old and gray oh but love like this don't come around don't come around every day every day I've never been quite sure for anyone else But here I am with you So I put my hesitations on the show Cause this is what I choose This will be the easiest thing if I let it And I can't be too afraid to fall I'm leaving everything on the table You can have my heart Adam, 
take Nicole to be your wife? And do you promise in covenant to be a loving, faithful, and loyal husband, a loyal husband to her for as long as you both shall live? I do. Nicole, do you take Adam to be your husband? And do you promise in covenant to be a loving, faithful, and loyal wife to him for as long as you both shall live? I do. God has heard these vows, and we indeed are witnesses of them. And so now as a token of the covenant they've entered, rings are given and received as a sign of your commitment to each other. And may God bless these rings, and you the givers and the wearers of them. So it's first the bride's ring to the groom. Aye. Wait, wait till the ring's on her finger, aye, because she can't take two things at one time, you know? <laughs> right, have you got the ring? Oh no, oh sorry, sorry. It's just when you were pointing in one direction, you know. <laughs> That's good, just first, first the groom's after. Good, just keep going. By these simple signs, you take each other to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish. Till death shall part you. You alright with now? I'm alright with you. You'll be in the red card. <laughs> in as much as you've. Yeah, carry on. <laughs> in as much as you have made those vows together and exchanged those rings, I pronounce you to be husband and wife in the name of the Father. <laughs> And of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. What God has joined, man should not separate. Is, does anybody have the uh, address of the local orthopedic department? <laughs> now after all that, yeah, you may now kiss the bride. <laughs>
now moving on to the main person in the room, my new wife, Nicole. <laughs> still can't believe she's still got her engagement ring on right enough. <laughs> Nicole still hasn't said you mar to marry me, but here we are. Me and Nicole always speak about special moments we've had together in our lives. And I think we can both agree that today definitely tops everything, except that actual arrival moment in Seville. <laughs> I really do believe we are perfect for each other. So I'd just like to thank Nicole for making me a better person, just being able to see life in a different way and always being by my side. I'd like to thank Nicole for all the planning she's done, for everything with the wedding and how beautiful she's made this venue. And back to when it all began. The first time me and Nicole met was actually in goals on point fives. <laughs> and here we are 12 years later on a wedding day. Then we did start dating and I thought, aye, this is going well, until one day we went for McDonald's and Nicole asked for a burger without the burger. <laughs> Thankfully we moved on for that. <laughs> on a serious note, Nicole, you really are the best person on the planet, so thank you for being you and I can't wait to see what the future brings. If you could all join me and raise one more glass to celebrate the new Mrs McCulloch. <laughs> Broken in two But something's different next to you It's like my soul is set on fire But oh, I'm starting to feel tired Cause I I can run, but I can't hide the feelings that I know I can't keep bottled up inside I can run, but I